today guys i bring you this easily missable musket s tier weapon for lords of the fallen this one you do not want to miss how's it going guys my name is dpj and if you do enjoy the video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe so i can probably guarantee you guys something and if i'm right you have to like this video deal okay and that is, I can guarantee you guys you have seen other S tier or claim to be S tier weapon videos or even S tier build videos, yet for none of the items within said videos to actually be S tier items. I know because I myself, I had a look. Every S tier weapon or S tier build video I checked out literally had not a single S tier item in them. Now S tier for those that do not know is basically the scaling of a weapon and what they can eventually be when they are maxed out and leveled up. Scaling is how damage is added to a weapon due to the investment of a specific stat like strength, agility, radiance and S is the absolute pinnacle, the best then followed by A all the way down to E being the worst. Now S tier weapons are ultra rare. I myself only know of a handful of them and I'll bring you videos on these. Today guys we check out the Bartholomew's Hammer. I believe that's pronounced that way. I'm probably wrong, I normally am. So as a hammer type weapon, this one scales with strength and radiance. Now though when maxed out to a level 10, it does only have a descaling for that strength, but when it comes to that radiance, it is one of a couple weapons I know of in the game that's an S tier radiance weapon, which is pretty amazing. And although initially for me, radiance is the one, well it's the main set I actually spec'd into due to the Pirate's Sword, that worked out perfectly for me because of this weapon. I absolutely love using it because it is ridiculously powerful. Now it states for me that the requirements to wield this and use it to its full potential is both a zero in radiance and strength. But I'm sure this was not the case. I don't know if this is just a, a visual glitch. I'm not sure. But on the Wikipedia either or guys it says it requires an 18 in that strength and 18 in radiance. So keep that in mind. Now what I will say is I believe this hits uh, a scaling at a level 9. So you can save yourself a Duralium chunk if you don't want to max it out, but still experience an S tier Radiance weapon. So to get this weapon guys, you need to be at that end game because it's located within Bramis Castle. So from the Bramis Castle Vestige of Bloody Pilgrim, uh, follow this path I take on screen now. Now if you've already been to this area, you've probably already unlocked shortcuts, but for those that haven't, this is the exact path you will have to take when you first get here. Now when you get to this area guys, you'll see a massive staircase. This needs to be rotated and to do this guys, you need to take out a mage. Upon you taking this mage out, it clears those red crystals for this lever. So use the lever and this turns the staircase. You can then guys head up the staircase and go in the right direction. Now halfway up guys we need to redirect slightly within the middle floor and grab the royal key which gives us access to the next area. So go from where I'm going guys and go to where I'm hitting this actual bookshelf. This is where the key is located. Once you have this key turn back on yourself and follow the path I take on screen.
Now, once you get here, guys, you need to take out this big guy or kite him away from this small little ledge. So I'll do what you gotta do here. Once you've kited him away or took him out, jump down and on this actual little platform, there is a Duralium Chunk for you to grab, which is obviously there's only four I believe you can pick up in the game. I mean, you can buy some from certain vendors, but they're super, super expensive for materials that are super, super hard to get. But the four you can acquire, this is one of them. And from here, guys, literally right where you'd place this seed at the angle between realms, here lies this hammer. This easily missable S tier weapon. So make sure you grab this while you are here, people. And there we have it, guys. This amazing Radiance S tier weapon you do not want to miss. Guys, if you've enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you know of any other S tier weapons, let me know down below. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on the next video.